our efforts have intensified to the point where the ruble collapsed, or virtually collapsed, yesterday, even though Russia's central bank doubled its interest rate. Now, we will do more with our friends to exclude Russian banks from the SWIFT system, freeze their assets, and restrict trade. And we will go further in our efforts to sanction those who are close to the Putin regime. As I speak, a column of tanks and armored vehicles, 25 miles long, is grinding south towards the golden domes of this ancient European capital, a city of nearly three million innocent people who have done nothing to deserve the carnage that Putin is unleashing in their country.